What's up, everybody? It is the end of the week again, and we are back. My name is Brian Hamawi with uh, Bella Trade Team, uh, brokered by Real, and I am with my good friend and colleague, Abiel. Hi, I'm Abiel Sanchez. I am with One Real Mortgage, and I am a loan advisor. Sweet. So today we are going to continue our uh, weekly updates on. Uh, uh, the economy, what's happening, and then on the lending side as well. So if you're an investor or first-time home buyer, you know exactly what's going on in the market, some of the changes and the updates. And we've had some updates this week, right? Oh, absolutely. It's gotten uh, really, really good for uh, those who are looking to purchase houses. So they're saying that the time is coming. The time is now. What the <laughs> heck are they talking about? That's a really good question. So the Fed actually came out and completely agreed with everything that has been said for the last few weeks. There's no more reading between the lines, people. It is time. They are saying that coming the September 18th meeting, there will be a cut. The chair for the Federal Reserve, Jerome Powell, came out and said the vast majority of the Fed has observed that it is time. Uh, there's a couple of things that have been steering this. Uh, one thing is unemployment. The rate jumped to 4.3 percent, which is really high. And another thing is that the July CPI, which is the consumer pricing index, otherwise how the economy is doing is slowing down and actually taking a negative turn. So what that means is we need to inject uh, the economy and the way to do that is to lower rates, so get raise spending. Okay, so rates are gonna come down. We expect that to happen when? So the great thing is that in August, it has already been happening. Mortgage rates usually react ahead of the curve. Uh, we actually had another small little bump down this morning, thanks to the news from the Fed. Uh, but once the Fed reacts, there will be more rate cuts coming after that. Okay, so we expect at least another rate cut this year. Do you think there's going to be two? And do you think it's going to happen before the elections? We're actually talking about two. Uh, it's one of those things that it can happen as if uh, things keep slowing down and the unemployment rate keeps going up, the pressure will rise on the Fed to make that second cut this year and even more come next year. So if you're, uh, you're in the market to buy a home right now, who's, who does this favor? Is this first time home buyers, investors, all of the above? All of the above. It's a great time to buy because we are now starting school. School is already starting up, which means that buyers are starting to slow down. So what that means is that you can actually uh, jump into a house w without the multiple offers, without having to worry about paying over asking price, anything to that effect. You actually have the opportunity to not only grab a pretty good rate right now, but grab a house at the best price possible. And then we could always refinance down the road and get that rate even lower. Okay, so if you're in the market to uh, purchase a home, whether you're a first time home buyer or an investor, it's a great time to do this. Um, you're going to get lower prices because we can negotiate those prices and then you're going to get the lower interest rate. So that monthly payment is going to come down significantly. If you're in uh, into investing in the short term rental space, Abiel, does this help the cash flow um, of the homes? Is it a good time to buy into vacation homes or investment properties? Then? That's a really good question, Brian. It really is. The, the great time right now would be to grab that house at the lower cost. And the rates have dropped, which, of course, helps with that cash flow and the ROI. Uh, once we refinance down the road, it'll help it even even higher. OK, well, I hope this helps everybody out there. And uh, if you've got questions, either drop us a comment below or uh, we've got all our information, our email addresses. Just reach out. Maybe we'll be happy to uh, answer any lending questions. If you're looking to buy a home in the central Florida market, uh, reach out to us. Um, we have agents all over the place and we'd be happy to help. Uh, if you've just got general questions, ask the questions. I'm sure other people would love to know the answers to those questions. For now, Sounds my good. name is Brian Hamawi. And this is ABL Sanchez. Have a great weekend and happy Friday.